Hello everybody, my name is Akriti Rai. I am originally from Nepal but currently based in New York for a master's degree program. Um, I recently took IELTS, the general training module, and I thought it would be a good idea to share uh, my experience with all of you. Uh, everybody watching this video, just make sure why you are taking the IELTS and what is the type of module that your institution is asking for, if it's academic or general. Uh, in general, academic is for academic purposes and the general training module is for licensing or training purpose or for migration to countries like Canada, Australia, UK, etc. So as we all know that IELTS is divided into four sections, the IELTS um, listening, reading, writing, and speaking. The listening part has 40 questions. You are allotted 30 minutes and you have 10 extra minutes to transfer your answer from the question paper to the answer sheet. So it's a total of 40 minutes. You are given a headphone. You listen to the conversation, the monologue, the speech, or the news report, and then you answer the questions. So it is 40 questions. You will be given four different patterns of conversations or monologue. The next one is the reading section. In the reading section, you will be given a um, couple of small texts. It has three parts. Section one will give you two to three text. Section two will give you two text, and section three will give you a long single text. You will have to find the answers there and you either have to fill in the blanks or match the following or complete the data table. You will be allotted 60 minutes in total. You will not have another extra 10 minutes to transfer your answer from the question paper to the answer sheet. So make sure you, tr you start transferring your answers to your answer sheet before uh, you finish your 60 minutes or you can also simultaneously write the answer in both the question paper and answer sheet and revise it later. And the other section is writing. The writing section um, is also an hour. You'll be given two tasks. Task one for 150 words and task two for 250 words. Task one with the 150 words will basically be writing a letter. It could be formal or informal. And your task two will be giving your opinion. It will be like an argumentative essay where you have to give in your opinion. Try to write more than the word limit. Um, because if you write less than the given word limit, then you might receive a score deduction. And um, the other section is speaking. I think to me personally, that was the easiest of all the sections because speaking will last for 10 to 15 minutes and will be based on your um, daily life, very relatable questions. You, It's divided into three sections. First, they'll ask you about yourself, the place you live, what you study, what you ate for breakfast, like very simple questions. And task two, each test taker will be given a topic. You will have one or two minutes to jot down the answers and then you will have to speak for two minutes until the test, until the examiner tells you that your time is over. And the third one will be a question and answer of what you spoke in task two. So it's pretty simple, the speaking section. So let me just revise what I spoke. Um, it's your listening section for 30 minutes, 40 questions. You will be given extra 10 minutes to transfer answers. The next is reading for 60 minutes, 40 questions. Writing section, one hour, which is 60 minutes. Recommended, 60. 20 minutes for the first, 40 minutes for the second. As we all know, the second carries double the marks than the first. And the last one is speaking, which will be for 10 to 15 minutes. So I hope you find this information useful. Uh, feel free to write down any comments or any constructive criticism is welcome. And if you've already taken an as did, I wish you all the best. And I hope I will come with more videos in the future for this as general on each section. Till then, you